Nobody's heard from him. I called the police, but you have to be missing for three days before they'll look for you. I mean, his phone probably just died, and I'm making something out of nothing. Yeah, my phone dies all the time, but I also still remember where I live. Yeah, I mean, if Jim went out in the morning to look for work and wasn't home by 2 a.m., he better not come home. <laughs> you could just, like, move in with whoever you were fucking. I literally didn't do anything, but this is a curious hypothetical. Do you guys think he's fucking somebody? No way, no. Come on, that's not Mag style. Oh no. my god, maybe he's fucking Jim. I mean, look, we all like Magnus, but there's an element of shadiness to him. You sense that, right? Yeah, I mean, he's very flirty, and he's got, like, all that really scary looking male. And the fucking beehive on the fire escape. What happens if we actually have a fire? Okay, but he's not shady. He's going through something, but before this, he's been a model boyfriend. Super fun, so affectionate, so great with my mom. And I mean, right now, it does feel like a whole other person. Yeah, a shady person. Okay, so, so what do I do? Definitely break up with him. Lots of people have credit card debt, right? I, I don't know. I, I don't know how crazy this is. I can't. Fifteen grand. He bought a motorcycle with a credit card. And I found this birthday card from this woman named Heather. And okay, so now the guy's not even allowed to have a fucking birthday card. Jim, I'm saying I don't know. Okay. Hi. Where have you been? Can we talk? Jim. 